Then we'll meet an extreme woman who's teaching others to live life to the limit. All this and more, if it's happening in L.A., it's happening right here on Your L.A. You're watching Your L.A. That was the hard part right there. Oh, really? I haven't always wanted to do this. I thought I would do this instead of bungee jumping, but it wasn't necessarily on my must do list. Now, you know what, that was so much fun. Looking at this again, I can remember my heart just all the way up in my throat. And when I landed, I immediately wanted to do it again. Now, from a distance, I think, oh, maybe not so much, but no, I actually would do it again. It was really empowering. And you know what, if you've ever thought about doing something crazy and wild, like say, for example, skydiving, but always seem to chicken out at the last minute, you may change your mind after watching this next interview. I had a chance to talk to a great lady who may finally be able to convince you to just go for it. Welcome back. I don't know about you, but when I hear the words KFC, I think chicken, but there's nothing chicken about our guest. Karen Blanchett, a.k.a. KFC, is a dynamo. This dynamo is an experienced sports extremist who is dedicated to helping others find happiness by living life to the fullest. Karen's here with us today to talk about her inspiring podcast, SkydiverGirls.com. First of all, how did you get into skydiving, and what is your goal for SkydiverGirls.com? Well, I'm actually afraid of heights, and <laughs> I, I know it's funny to say that a lot of skydivers are, and I think it's important to go out and gain confidence and do fun things, and the message for skydiver girls is get off the couch, go out and have fun. It doesn't have to be skydiving. It can be motorcycling or, or whatever your thing is. Uh, the thought, hey, I could never do, should never be in your vocabulary. Mm -hmm. So go out and have fun, be confident, be safe, learn about your sport, and that's what it's about. We're watching some great video here. Now, I know that you started your podcast this summer. You do it once a month. And each time you are presenting a new girl with a new story, right? And what's your goal there? Absolutely. I want to introduce girls next door, regular people like you and me and your listeners. Um, people think that, oh, they come from another planet, these crazy skydivers or evil Knievels or whatever. And they're regular people. They, you go to school with them. You see them on the streets. These are regular people just like you, and they could be you. Mm -hmm. And so I introduced the girl, and she talks about, hey, you know, I'm a waitress at wherever. And, right. yeah, I skydive, and here are the safety things we went through. What do you love about skydiving personally? I love how serene and free-feeling it is. People don't know that it's so... <sighs> Like mm -hmm. flying like a bird, it really is. Sure, there's a lot of wow excitement to it, but there really is a lot of serenity and relaxation, and it's like a weight is off your shoulders when you're skydiving. I agree with you. You know, I went on a jump, and I was watching your video, and it takes like 10 to 12 minutes to get up to the altitude where you need to mm -hmm. jump, and I was just thinking, I can't believe I have 10 to 15 minutes to think about the fact that I'm going to jump out of an airplane. <laughs> it's so scary, but once you release, it's perfect. And the pull for you about extreme sports is what? For the most part, it helps me let the little things go. Exactly, and I know that you wanted to be uh, a little bit more frequent with your podcast. Why yeah. did you decide to go into podcasting even as a platform in terms of doing this show? Well, we wear cameras on our helmets and the skydives all the time anyway, or oh, most okay. of the time, yep. because that's how we train and, and we know what happened in the skydive. And so I had all this footage, mm -hmm. and I wanted to share it with people and show it to other people. And I thought, you know what, I really, really want to be empowering. And I've done some other things in my past where uh, radio shows and such where I've tried to be empowering to people. And I think that the visual aspect that you get with podcasting today and the way the Internet's going, why not? It's an easy fit. It's, it's perfect. I Anybody absolutely can get agree. It anywhere yeah. in the world. That's right. Thank you so much, yeah. KFC. Really appreciate your time. And, you know, skydiving really takes your breath away. I'm sure that's pretty obvious. And you can catch more episodes of Skydiver Girls at skydivergirls.com. Or you can also subscribe with iTunes.